Hello everyone, this is Trosum here, and today I'm going to be showing you a Toro Gray 3D crystal puzzle. Uh, this was, this was, um, this was a uh, late Christmas gift that my brother got me, uh, and I saw, and I saw this, uh, I saw this in my, in my shelf, uh, as soon as I, as uh, I, uh, came, came home from, uh, Montana, that's where my grandparents live, let's just open this up. We got uh, instructions. And we basically have to do is well well you just have to like put them in order and then and then fit and try to fit them together. And the other side is where you put in the uh well put in the rest of the stuff in. All right. Okay, so let's get all the pieces sorted. All right, so I separated all the pieces, <clears throat> including the including the key. I think this is supposed to be just a sep a separator. All right, so let's just start. This one's not fitting in. Alright, never mind. Hmm. Yeah, this is a jigsaw puzzle. It doesn't require the guesswork. Oh, there you go. I got it. Well, I made a jigsaw puzzle. This has instructions. I mean, that's because it's a 3D puzzle, of course. Hmm. Yeah, that piece is too big. Uh, oh, there you go. Hmm. This is going to fail. Uh, no, it fits. Hmm. Maybe this is the wrong side? No, it's the right side. Okay, then. Unless you have the piece upside down, so just uh, flip it around. 
And put this piece on there. There we go. All right. And then grab this piece. And we're going to cut it. Hmm. Up here. No, no, uh, no. Right here. And I think to make it easier, I think I would rather just put it on the table. All right. Let's get this piece. And where do I put it? Where do I put it? No. That's. And. There we go. Hmm. <coughs> And for this piece, let's put it in here, I think. Oh, there you go. And then this piece. This goes here. And then, yeah, I can do that one. Uh, and this one, it goes... Alright, nothing in shape. Let's see. There we go. Yes. Hmm. This one goes like that. And then this one. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, I know I never put this one in. Oh, there it is. Hmm. So I put this one. Oh, right there. And then this one. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's that. That one. This. Um. Like that. And we have this piece that's not a jigsaw. Uh, we put it The problem is it doesn't want to fit in. Oh, did it just fit in? There you go. Alright. And then, uh, uh, let's see. No, well, I mean, first of all, I need this. This is an arm. It's not as easy as you think. Um, oh, wait. Oh, you're supposed to put it before. So that's... And then put it here. Now the real problem with the set is that the pieces is, just does not want to fit in, and because it's clear plastic, it's really hard. It's really hard to tell where where it, exactly it goes. No, oh, it goes like this. Okay. Okay, there we go. And then just put it up here, I think. No. Come on. There you go. And put this. 
And here, and this, and um, no, there you go. Come on, where is it? Where did I put it? And this piece, let's see. I think I gotta turn it around. There you go. And then for this piece, we put it in here. And then you have a stick, we just shove in the hole. And then there's a face piece. Go like that. And then we put the eyes in. Uh, oh, I missed one. Uh, the eyes aren't going to be easy because how tiny they are. Doesn't want to fit. I, I think I put it upside down. No, no. I think I put it. Come on. Oh, there you go. Got one in. There you go. And let's see. Let's put the uh, ears on. If we even stick in. <laughs> Maybe we could have to pull this up. Nah, I don't think he... Yeah, the ears don't really, uh... The ears don't really peg into the stick. So that's the problem. Come on, I put him in the right place. It just does not want to fit in. Alright, so I just managed to get the ears in. Although, it was it was not very easy because it was really tight. So let's just put the top of the umbrella in, uh... Here. And there you go. There's the Totoro puzzle.
And as you can see, he's all gray, of course, because that's what it says in the packaging. This one, he's blue, but, I mean, it clearly says gray. But they didn't use the gray version. And there's also, like, the key. Then again, it's really just, just to, uh... Uh, it's just to like make it easier to like remove certain pieces but I don't really need it now <laughs> so uh, yeah and in the bottom there's like a hole in there but that's because it was it was supposed to, you're supposed to put a stick in it just to make it hold together um, let's see uh, it doesn't really do anything really it's really just kind of a, a statue a statue really um now, I don't really know who this character actually is. He's probably, like, f from a certain a certain uh, anime movie, I think. Or or just a, an anime show. Um, I don't really I don't really watch anime that often. Mainly because I just play video games and play my laptop uh, most of the time in my life. So, yeah. Um, this was not... This was not an easy build. It was, it was kind of annoying... Because, like, certain pieces didn't want to, like, fit together. Uh, especially the, uh, the ears. And it did require a bit of guesswork because, you know, it's a puzzle. But not as much of a guesswork as a 2D jigsaw puzzle. So, yeah, that's it for today, guys. So, it's like, comment, and subscribe. I also forgot to mention that, uh, this set also, uh, included a, uh, a catalog. And there's also, and yeah, there's that robot. It's a yellow robot. Uh, it normally, um, I mean, I actually remembered seeing this, uh, robot in, uh, Barnes & Noble, but it was, it was a red version. And there's, and you have, a uh, Pikachu in it. Um, you also have Dorymon. Uh, let's see, what else? Oh, wait. Uh, it flips out like this. And let's see, they got Gundam, they got Astro Boy, they even got Peanuts. Um, uh, I really wish they could have a uh, a full body, uh, uh, a full body of gun of uh, Gundam as a crystal puzzle. And uh, could you imagine how hard that would be? It would probably even be harder than the model kits. I mean, I don't really, I, I never really had, had much trouble building the model kits. I mean, they're not, at, at least they weren't as hard as this one. So yeah, then again, like, comment, and subscribe, and Happy New Year! And another thing I forgot to mention is that uh, this key actually does have a uh, purpose. Because I looked at the instructions, and uh, you actually need to... Uh, to uh, screw in the stick. Let's just do that. See? You actually have to like screw it in. Which is exactly what I did. I'm sorry if you didn't see that in camera. And now we can just put the, the uh, ears in. I think. Yeah, I think that's as far as it could go. And then just put the umbrella back on. Something like that. And, uh, no, I can't really spin around because the ears are on the way. Um. Yeah, that's how, yeah, I think that's how far it goes. Can't make it straight. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So then again, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and Happy New Year.